Zika virus is a mosquito-borne virus that has emerged recently in the Americas. It's a virus that had typically been seen in other parts of the world in the tropics. It requires a mosquito to transmit it, or maybe rarely in blood transfusion, or rarely by sexual transmission. Many people who are infected with this virus are going to have no symptoms at all, or they'll have symptoms that are mild and consistent with the flu. The issue is if you're infected when you're pregnant, there's a potential that can cause birth defects. That's something that we have seen in association, but whether it's causal, we, we just don't know that information yet. We may see other, other problems that come to light, but so far, you know, it's nothing like Ebola. At present, we really don't have any specific treatments or ways to prevent infection with Zika virus other than to reduce the burden of the mosquito population. Make sure you don't have stagnant water sitting around in artificial containers around your household. If you can get rid of that, you're cutting off the breeding site there. Certainly insecticides, particularly aerial insecticides, can be effective against these mosquitoes. Another thing, of course, is insect repellent. That's a great strategy for dealing with it. I think the big takeaway is that most, most pregnant women will not be at risk in this country. So if you're pregnant and you have a trip to one of the potentially affected areas, the first thing that you should do is go to the CDC website and see what the status of that country might be. If it's currently affected and this is non-essential travel for you, then you probably should not take that trip. But updates change pretty regularly, and so the CDC website will have the most recent updates in terms of travel.